Eternal Arbiter. God woken. This one here already looks like a huge pool of souls. I mean, look at all the very small puddles we usually have, which give like one source point. It looks like hundreds of source points, depending on how deep it is. Are your studies complete? I am ready. All Godwoken have completed their studies. I take you now to the arena of the One. The wellspring awaits the victor. There Here we you go. may fall, or you may rise. Here we go, divinity. Just within our reach. So it begins. The first Godwoken to enter the wellspring of ascension becomes divine. May the new divine be worthy. For the rest, may he have mercy on your soul. You can do this. Especially since we're six against one. To the wellspring of ascension. Begin. And just to show you something. Uh, I'm too f Yeah. Look at that. We're not talking about some puddle. Of souls. It is waves. It's a huge lake full of souls. So. Huh. Lose is not part of the battle. Lose doesn't care. Be like Lose. Uh, yeah, we just have one enemy. And here we go. Alright, Shred Prince. Here we go. Sacrifice. Jesus, I never realized how deep it is. It is insane. It is so much source. I mean, just imagine when you see like dead people lying around and they leave this puddle of source. Imagine how many people this source is. Because I mean, in the end, it kind of seems like a soul is connected to the source or something. It's insane. Uh, back to Usabil. And hello, Red Prince. Very nice to make your acquaintance. Quite the bloody affair. Corrupt attendance. And chicken time. Here we go. Do -do 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 -do. Ah, come on. So yeah, usually, depending on what you do, it can be like 4 against 3, or like 3 against... No, 4 against 2, it can be, if you also play yourself an origin character, or if you don't, like we do it right now, usually it's like 3 against 3. Uh, 4 against 3, so you always have like more people in your team. But yeah, this one here was incredibly rigged, I'd say. So yeah, that was the epic battle for Divinity. And I mean, yours can of course be worse if you don't get to um, convince your companions to support you. And there are sentinels around. Um, let's just wait, let them come to us. Oh no. Laser beam. No laser beam. Just laser shot. Here we go. Neat. And hello to you. Also interesting that there's still sentinels like we already killed the other god woken. <laughs> and I mean, then again, I 
guess the Eternals shouldn't want the God King to actually win. If only they are just, I don't know, too weak to interfere. looking in that direction, right? That means we can backstab. Uh, here we go. Right? Yeah. What is your hat? Um, their sacrifice. And daggers drawn. Slowly but surely. Let's hope our characters don't slip. But I guess that's wishful thinking. They actually fed better than I expected. But there we have it. The Well of Ascension. There it is. The wellspring. Just a few steps it's almost over. left. Right. Oh. So good of you to come, God Awoken. You know, you are many things, but above all, you are reliable. Reliable to the point of being predictable. I hate you Dallas. To the wellspring. I With follow. With all my heart. I hate her so much I have to sneeze. <laughs> The Lady Vengeance is, after all, my ship. And now here we all are. And I have a very bad feeling. And you see that thing on her back? That also looks... A very weird contraception, right? Contraption. It is time, mistress. She gives you a long and steady look. As if it is the last time you shall see each other for the rest of eternity. Mm. Then she dips her chin in acknowledgement. You are almost her equal. Almost. And the question still remains, who's that cloaked figure? Quite powerful at that. But I mean, look at them. They're both level 17. We could take them. Yes, Breederman. It is time. Breederman. She raises the Aetiran. Like a divining rod to water, it seeks the wellspring and finds it. The device hums to life. And we know that it absorbs source. So she's going to destroy the wellspring. There goes Divinity. We are done, mistress. And look how deep the well is. And there goes Divinity. And now she's probably incredibly powerful, if not divine herself. And after all those trials, they could just barge in here? Damn it. Yes, Breederman, we are done. And so too, Godwoken, are you. Soon you shall be little more than relics of a bygone time, and this place shall be your tomb. Goodbye. Not good. There goes Divinity. If this was BT3, we could just push her off the griff. <laughs> off the bridge, nice. Mm. It might be wise to look for a way out again. Uh-huh. Really? Do you think so? If I didn't if it was me. our shark had everything under control, I'd think we were in big trouble. Ah, uh, it would be so satisfying to just push uh to just push um Dallas off a bridge. We just slay her. Uh, friends, are you coming? The ritual has failed. The structure lies in ruins, but you have at least survived. 
You should feel relief, disappointment, confusion, anything but the rage that wells up from deep within you. Well, I guess the rage deep within us is not ourself. The rage grows, burning hotter than the volcano itself, tearing at you, seeking to overpower your senses. The red mist wants to descend. The red mist feels like it does not belong to you. The red mist feels alive. Our lovely gods. And it wants you. A familiar figure materializes before you. A copy of yourself, enraged. Your own face glows at you in hateful fury. It opens its mouth. And no matter who, embodiment of Relic, Amaria, Relic once more. A Relic twice. Hmm. Ah, no. Hmm. I can't look at the, the others. But I'm still confused why we have Relic twice. Because I would have guessed for... Well, for Ifan it's Relic. For Fane it's Amaria. For Beast it's Duna. For Sibyl it's Tercentilius. For us it's Tercentilius. But for Lose it should be the demon, right? Hydro Malik. And your furious god begins to speak. We are. Tercentilius, Duna, Tercentilius. Remember me. This has not gone as planned, and the fault is yours. You have brought the elves to their ruin. You have failed me. Sure, blame us. You have renounced me. Okay, well, sure, we did that. I own you. I have tasted your flesh. Charming. I know that you know this is true. You have given of yourself to me. I didn't give myself to you, you took part of my flesh. A memory returns, a sacrifice at an altar on the island. The god smiles and seems to grow. Ah, uh, but there wasn't a decision, was it? Now you shall give me your all. Your body, your soul. The others are coming and I have work to do. I must mm. do what you could not. I must become the one god of this world. Surrender to me. Do not dare defy me. It won't hurt at all. I don't trust you one bit. I think it's time for you to end, Tercendelius. Neil. Oh, interesting. We could actually do that, but of course we don't do that. I would never ask for any of this. And Lavender stands tall. He sighs in disappointment. Did you really expect me to just give in? Let me show you the error of your ways. Uh huh. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's kill the sorry excuses of gods we have around here. Now I feel. A little bit sorry for Amadia, but in the end, she's just as shitty as everyone else. Fantasa is nice. Okay, I would love to use some kind of area of effect thing, so we're just going to wait. Ow. Oh, gosh. Alright. Oh, we could go for Chain Lightning. Let's go for Chain Lightning. Nice. And Pressure Spike. Let's Soul Vampire him. <laughs> Unfortunately, Soul Vampirism is not that useful in battles, at least in my opinion. Ow. Um, what are you doing here, Fane? Oh lord. Wasn't he here? Wasn't he here? Uh, okay. What we're going to do. Ah, but if we do with the time warp, we can't do the meteor shower. Let's kill them too. And let's hope we don't hit E plant too often. Nice. Annoying. Damn. 
damn it. Stop that. Okay. What we do, hailstorm here. To take some of you out. Mm, yeah, here we go. Let's just focus on those two. Sorry, you found my laugh. Yeah. What was that? Reactive armor. Yikes. Okay, embodiment of Amaria. You are almost dead. But you're frozen. So don't have to worry about you. Um, unfortunately, I think it would be wise to resurrect these. I mean, unfortunately, in that regard, that I can't use uh, Losa. Yeah. And encourage. Let's kill the first god. It's also kind of odd at this point that you can have two embodiments. Why aren't you frozen? Wasn't she frozen? Yeah, what I wanted to say is. It is kind of odd that you can have like two embodiments of the same god, right? Shouldn't be able to reside in two bodies at the same time, I guess. Mm -hmm. Ah, we need beast. Come on. Go, cast skill, beast. Target is too far, so let's get here. We did it again. Beast here. I'm ready. All right, Sibyl. Go here. Go sacrifice. And let's paint the floor red with Chiasadelias. I uh, can't use Dagger Strong. Oh well. And we can't backstab. That sucks. <laughs> Go, atrophy. And... Mm. Mm. It's a chain lightning once more. Oh. Yeah, at least two. Pressure spike. We did that before, didn't we? Okay, you have atrophy. How about we also make you silent? Ah, won't be, won't work. Mm. Kind of nice. Uh, less effective than I hoped it would be. I don't like that it's... I mean, why didn't I just do the chicken claw? Here we go. Divine chicken. Oh, wing chicken. Chicken wings. Already roasted. Nice. Lining squall, here we go. Uh, maybe we should take care of a Maria. Because I really want to get rid of her. Come on. And goodbye, first half of Relic. And a Maria. Oh no. The bill is frozen. We have to take care of that. Yeah, and Fane can just travel. Here we go. Into the fire. Oh, and Ethan is not part of the fight. That's weird. Well, here we go. Is he not becoming part of the fight? Also the Soul Wolf. Now the Soul Wolf is now part of the fight. Um no. Fundament of Relic. Let's just boost our Soul Wolf then, right? Weird. That Fane here is is part of the fight, but a wolf isn't. We take it.
anyway. Whose turn is it? Fate's turn. Ugh. Ah, come on. Oh no. Please don't attack again. Did he just... What did he bless? Hmm. Okay, if you want to do well and stuff, we can do that as well. There we go. Nice. Uh, we can't do anything more. Let's hope we survive. Oh, hey. We did survive. Who would have thought? get someone to die, probably this one here, right? I could go after the chicken. Mm. Uh, let's try to get rid of Justin Delius. Uh, oh gosh, is that close? Here we go. <coughs> the bill resisted death. Good for her. It's the resisting. I like it. Mm. Well, she will die. Uh, or maybe let's give her some magical armor. That could save her. Oh, hey, Beast is also just barely alive. 45 hit points, that's nothing. Okay, embodiment of relic. Another swap. We're putting Ethan up here. I'm ready. Is he still a part of the fight? Here we go. Okay, I think that's kind of bugged. So let's maybe keep Ethan out of the battle. Don't want to cheat too much or at all. We go. No. Come on, Roman. Run. Nah. Run away. Ha. Dodging for the win. Uh. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we have to bother with Fane. But hey, let's see if he slips. Oh, impressive. But now he slips. I am impressed. Fame. Go. Glory is mine. Yep. More. So, last on standing is Tessendelius. What an epic final battle. Great. Well, I guess we do not hit. Uh, just two AP and like that. Uh, but here we go. Source Titan. I am the last. I am the one. You are nothing. And I always wondered about the scene. Like, I am the last. What happened to the other seven lords? What happened to Santeza? What happened to 
uh, raw gear, what happened to all the others? I mean, the last one of the seven lords here in this arena, sure. I don't like to fight against you. Um, let's restore some magical armor before we get annihilated. Oh hey, maybe let's turn invisible. Titan's right. Hi. Oh hey, sudden freezing. We take it. There we go. Even more freezing. Come here. Won't be too much of a battle. Just some Delius. That's kind of nice that it started with him. And now it ends with him. Immune to bleeding. Also immune to fire damage? Yeah. I hate it. Immune to fire damage is most annoying. Oh, poison. Also immune. How about earth damage? Uh, you take that, cool. There you go. Glory nice. is the glory is... Alright, loser. Don't think you can do too much though. Completely honest, but hey, we'll try. So, onslaught. I think one of the first times we do that. And it's mediocre, isn't it? Hmm. Now we don't have to bother with physical damage. Interesting. Same with Amadia. The frozen just disappears. Yikes. Where is it? Three kills. Oh, seriously. Okay, we can do this. It's actually harder or has causes more casualties than I thought. Here we go. Condemnation. Uh, Come here. Are you immune to poison, true? I hate it. Immune to poison, immune to fire. That's not a cool combination. Here we go. And here we go again. Throwing knife. Ah, it would have been so nice to kill him with a throwing knife. With such a simple, easy attack. I'm ready. Come on. The bill gets to kill Tercentilius, also nice. I'd say the Titan lies yeah. in pieces before you. The god controlling it is dead by your hand. Uh, I hope it doesn't have any implications that Lavender's dead. Lava royals as earthquakes rumble around you. Shockwaves of sound pierce the air, the growl of shifting ground. Suddenly, a voice echoes in your mind. It's Malady. Where the hell Ooh. are you, she calls. Ah, find my beacon. We need to get out of here now. Her voice crackles and dissipates in your mind. Melody, once more saving the day. It's so weird that Ifan is just out of combat. Okay, here we go. Lavender. Here we go. Beast. We leave no one behind. And you know what? Just for simplicity's sake. I think we're just going to take Ifan to go here. To the beacon. Of course it's not hard. You just have to... Like, kind of time that you don't get attacked by the fire. And it's turn-based, but no enemies spawn or anything. So I don't feel bad about using this. Here we go. 